Hi, I'm Kenneth Weidsta. I'm a professional photographer here in Colorado and welcome to another one of my photography talks. Today I'm going to talk about gear. Specifically old and a little bit heavy gear. So I like to carry a tripod everywhere I go and sometimes I don't want to take a big tripod. This is a small Gitsu tripod. I got this at a flea market right here in town one day and there was a guy selling kind of like a junk sale every Saturday next to his house and it seemed like he was in business because he was doing it every week. He left the tents up. But he had this and it has this little head that's built in and it's got legs that you can pull these deals out and make it go low to the ground. And it's Gitsu, so of course it's quality. But it's not carbon fiber, it's aluminum. So it was made probably, I'm guessing, in the 70s or 80s and it's called a 126 Total Lux, if I can read that. And I can't hardly read it. But it's a uh, it's the kind of thing where it's like even when you're shooting with a small portable tripod, you know these little tabletop tripods and they're plastic and they kind of want to fall over as soon as you set them up. This is the kind of thing that you can keep with you and it doesn't weigh that much. It weighs more than those little tabletop flimsies but this is a quality simple tripod. It's only this tall and I can keep this with me when I'm going to a friend's house, going to a party, and I want to do a portrait where I want the control of tripod. Or if I'm shooting a 500 millimeter lens that I talked about, and I want to have stabilization, but I don't want to carry a big tripod because I'm going somewhere. Maybe I'm walking somewhere. This is the kind of thing I can strap to my bag and it's not terribly heavy. It's not terribly big. You don't want to really put it to full extension, certainly, to, and use it. But these old tripods, I think I may have paid $40 for it. These old tripods are, you only need one small little tripod like this and it'll last you forever because it's already lasted that long. You know, these kind of tripods, they don't, aren't made flimsy and they don't break. If you buy the carbon fiber, they're going to cost you a lot. And they're very, very expensive new and very expensive even used. But these older ones that are aluminum, don't pay those prices for aluminum. They're not that light. They get cold in the winter time versus carbon fiber, which they, you know, not so cold like a metal does. And you can pick these up cheap. And this is like, if you're looking to surprise yourself with a little birthday gift, little holiday gift that you want for yourself, you're looking for something that you can spend a few bucks on, but not a lot. This is a great addition to your kit because you'll use it frequently as opposed to those little flimsies that fall right over. If you want to go hiking with it, if you want to take it to the beach. This is the kind of thing that you can probably keep your camera out of the sand if you have something that has a little bit of quality to it and isn't going to fall over. All right, that's the Gitsu small tripod. It sounds like a Ginzu knife or something, but it's a Gitsu. Made in France. All right, that's today's photography talk. If you're enjoying these, hit the subscribe button. We'll talk some more. Thanks so much for watching.